Hey guys, this is Trombone and Tubi here doing another video for you guys today. Um, yeah, uh, sorry for the real late upload. It's around 10 o'clock at night. I just wanted to fit this video in before tomorrow because I'm getting ready for vacation. Uh, won't be doing any videos uh, really on this channel next week because I won't have any instruments with me. So, yeah, if I find any like music and wherever I'm going, I'll probably film it and put it on my channel. Because uh, it's not just lessons and reviews on this channel. It's more of... It's more of like anything music related or anything. I'll probably going to be starting to make my own songs pretty soon. So yeah, this video, uh, let, we're going to get uh, way into this video uh, right now. Uh, today is actually a very special video because one of these type of instruments you really don't see that much and they're really expensive. So uh, I really suggest, I don't know how you're going to get one. But this video is the use of an F attachment trombone. Now if you think about when you say an F attachment trombone, what do you think? I usually think it's pitched in F. Well, kind of it is, actually. It has a second tuning slide and a whole bunch of extra tubing. Uh, the slide is a little bit longer, and I'll show you the um, trombone right here. Um, you've probably seen it in maybe a few of my other videos, but this is an F attachment trombone. Um, it's, a it's, like a te it's a tenor trombone. Uh, it's all the same. The, the, just the slide's a little wider. Um, the bell is normally the same, but then there, you see there's all this extra tubing up here. There's like, besides this one pipe that goes around like this, there's also these two little pipes that are inside here, and there's this little like slit here that you press, like a, the valve they call it, and there's this little cap here that opens and closes uh, when you're inside the uh, instrument. Uh, the use of this instrument is just a tenor trombone, but it's got these extra tubes. Now, why do we have these extra tubes up here? Now, that question can be answered easily. This is just allowing you to play different notes easier, actually. It, it may be easier, and you can play some actually notes you can't play on a tenor trombone, like a B-flat tenor. Um, yeah, so we'll be doing that comparison later on, but first I'm going to show you the stuff we can do on this trombone. So, um, first thing, uh, it's all the same. It's all pitched in B-flat. <laughs> Of course, we got spit, and this is a very old model, so the, the bell tends to like move around a little bit more. Of course, the B flat. Now there's this trigger here, and you're like, hold on a second. So when you flip this trigger, you're serious. Like you flip this trigger, this pipe opens up and allows air through these two tubes here. Yeah, pretty cool, right? So say you want to play a C, right? C is sixth position. And you're like, what if you have to do that many times? Like, it's a part of the song that goes... It's much easier to just hit the valve, actually. Because all that plays C. Of course, it's got to be tuned, but you get the idea that hitting the valve... See, it's a lot easier than just hit to just hit this valve than instead of going all the way out to sixth position because you can play it a lot faster. That's one um, pro of the um, F trombone. Also, the low F. You can play that in first position with the trigger too. So you can go instead of going out to six. Except for first position with F, uh, low F in first position, it's kind of going to be a little bit flat, so you should tune it. Uh, the way to tune these trombones are actually really simple, too. You just pull out this little, like, the tuning slide is right here, this little one. And uh, it's really tuned right now, actually. It's, like, barely anything, so. Um, also, I can also go down, starting from a low F, and I can get down to a low pedal tone B flat just by hitting this valve. I'm gonna start on the low on the B flat, the low B flat. I'm gonna uh, gra uh, gradually make my way down to the uh, B flat below that. I can see that I just played C, D, and E flat. We're just hitting this valve. Opened up all this extra tubing, and it makes the tube a little longer. Because if you wanted to play E flat, you'd have to go all the way out here. 
seventh position is really far out, as you see. So, I'm actually going to go grab my tenor trombone without an F attachment and show you what I can do compared to this trombone. All right, here I am with my tenor trombone. As you see, it has no F attachment, just has the normal standard tubing. Now, um, not really going to make a difference with the mouthpiece, first of all, before I get into playing. I just use a 12C or a 6.5 AL. 6.5 AL is a bigger cup. 12C is just the normal standard student size mouthpiece. So, um, this trombone can do everything this the other trombone can do, except move the trigger. <laughs> trigger so but on this trone uh, trombone if you look out at my other videos like the false tone video definitely check that one out that one will show you how to do false tones now I'll show you a little bit of that in this video too now if you want to hit like a C or something just like try and think of the note above it and just pretend to move your mouth to a C doesn't work. The lowest you can get on these little standard tenors, if you look at my pedal E flat on a standard student trombone, is just move the tuning slide out all the way and then play a seventh position. That's a low E flat, and that's I think the lowest you can go on these things. I mean, you can hit the B flat if you're lucky. But as no comparison, like nothing. Comparison, comparison to this trombone. This trombone can do a lot more. It can go all the way down. So that's pretty much the use of the F attachment trombone. Um, yeah, thank you for watching everyone. Um, I'll definitely be able to uh, upload a few more videos before I go on vacation because I'll be leaving Monday and I'll be back on Sunday. So. Between those seven days, I won't be able to upload any videos that involve instruments unless I see anything to keep you guys updated and where I am. So I will see you guys. Um, I'm, I think I'm making an extra upload later tonight. So see you guys and thank you for watching.